Hey guys, I promised that we would open up another can of Compiz this week, and I'm delivering on that promise. I've noticed that there's a lot of demonstrations of Compiz Fusion out there, but not very many tutorials on how to actually produce these amazing little wobble effects and, and things like that. And last week I showed you guys how to do kind of the more picturesque pretty things, and I will get to the cube, but this week I wanted to show you some of the functionality aspects. Like like we talked about um, the expo where you can zoom out look at different desktops at once and scale I have some of the compass fusion extra effects already enabled so if you check out my previous videos you can learn how to do that but for now we'll go to the CCSM and choose general options and then desktop size horizontal virtual size and I'm just gonna choose five now you can click on the desktops or the workspaces to switch between them. And they show up uh, on if you hover the mouse on the lower right by default. Anytime I say CCSM, it's Compass Config Settings Manager, and you can go to System Preferences and select that. So now I'm going to show you how to do a little wobbly window. So just go to the wobbly windows tab in the CCSM, and I have to disable snappy windows and bam your your windows wobbly it's that easy but we're here for functionality so let's get back to that now to my favorite scale and we're going to go back to the extra section of our friendly ccsm scale you want to click initiate window picker and then you can set the settings with the thumbnail window size allows you to choose how large the preview will be so then you hover over the window in the panel on the lower left which is by default and then you can just switch between the workspaces pretty seamlessly cool huh now we want to enable the expo plugin so we're going back to ccsm and expo is what allows us to zoom out and see all of the viewports at once and rearrange the windows between them the expo edge click none and when the monitor pops up it resembles your own so you just select which section you want the or which edge you want expo to pop up and now you can see all my workspaces and finally, I'm going to show you window previews and make sure all of the following boxes are checked. Um, sometimes people forget to check them. It's really easy to do that. So we're in window preview now and I want to select the size of my thumbnail image when I hover over. There's a sliding bar for that. It's all just another way to manage and observe your workspaces. So I hope you enjoyed your big refreshing gulp of Compass Fusion 101 productivity style with a little bit of fun extras thrown in there. And speaking of fun extras, next week I will be showing you how to do the cube, the sphere, and the cylinder. So that will be the icing on the cake as far as my Compass Fusion tutorials go, and I hope to see you next week. Take it easy. Bye.